Hi, and welcome back to another video of the Ipsy. I'm a little bit late this month. A little bit late in, in general, because I haven't really been doing these. But, but this month I got really excited and decided I wanted to do this one and try and get back into doing them. So, we got the month of May to look at, and I'm really excited. So, let's so First off, this is a really cute bag. It's all sparkly and it's not too rough. It, and doesn't none of the glitter comes off of my finger, so this is a good one to carry around if I ever get around to it. I have so much from from the Ebsy though. I don't know what all I'm gonna do with it, but you know, it's pretty. It's sparkly and gold. But you know, the bag isn't what we're here for, is it? The first product that I have is this beautiful Velvet Liquid Lipstick by uh, Ola Neon in FOMO. I don't know which order it is, honestly, but it's FOMO Ola Neon Velvet Liquid Lipstick. And it goes on in a beautiful matte. I'm wearing it now. I don't know if you can see it in the light, but I am wearing like a clear top to make it, you know, shiny this time around, but goes on real pigmented and it is so pretty and I love it, especially when I'm going for like a darker look like this. And it also uh, stays on pretty well. I could touch my finger to it and it won't come off. It's awesome second product we have is the Bad Gal Bang Bigger Batter Volumizing Mascara. And this one's just a smaller one. I feel like I got like a full size of the uh, lips, lip gloss, but and this one's just a little sample size, but it's iffy about mascaras for me, but I do love it. And I haven't used this one yet. I've used most of the products, but I have been really set on using some of the mascara that I've already have. So I haven't really gotten around to using this, but it looks good. It looks real soft. Gives like a, a decent, uh, it seems like it could give like a subtle kind of volume. Which sometimes I like to go for. It's like I, I still have one that I use that isn't like boom volume. So, uh, so yeah, uh, I'll see. I'll see what it is later. <laughs> uh, next product is the Kaleido Cosmetics Skin Blush Soft as Skin Blush, and cute little box and it says it's cruelty free no matter what <laughs> that's good don't don't want any cruelty in my makeup no and it even comes with in a uh, little mirror and this is a cute little pink I don't know what else to say it's a blush <laughs> it's very subtle coming off on the finger and it is it's light it's peachy I guess is the word for it probably can't really see it in this lighting uh, right out uh, right under the uh, mascara sample but pretty it goes it's real smooth it feels like and it feels like it could go on really nice I'll definitely be using that, especially since my blush is starting to run out that I have already. <laughs> so, any sort of blush I love to use. Next product is the Radiant Glow Highlighter by Ibby Beauty. Ibby Beauty? I never know how to pronounce any of these, so forgive me. 
but it is Get Glowing. Our ultra fine high impact formula will pop all your favorite features. So that's it's promising, isn't it? And it's it's cute. It's definitely sample size, <laughs> but it is very compact. And even right off the bat, it's very shiny and pretty, and I love it already. I'm gonna swatch it on the finger. You probably see it. And ooh, kind of a subtle highlight. I put it under the um, lip gloss. You can. It has a bit of a sheen to it, which is nice. I love that. I love anything with sheen, anything with shiny glowiness. Oh, it's so pretty. With a specific amount, I don't. It's like I do love being blinding, but not blinding. I can't be looked at. <laughs> and last but not least, the. I feel I am probably going to butcher all of this. This is the Gardenia Shea Butter Hand Cream by La Le Le Chatel Le I I don't really know. I but it says it's made in France, so and I have a lot of trouble like um pronouncing names <laughs> so this isn't too much of a surprise but I've used it before and it smells really clean and it definitely like seeps into your skin but it doesn't leave you like oily or anything and it definitely like it leaves you soft but not slimy. <laughs> but uh, it's good. I like it. This is my Ipsy of May 2019 glam bag. And I am really happy with this. I got some. My favorite is the lip gloss, obviously. It is just perfect for this kind of look kind of um so yeah I definitely think I'm being a little bit more narrowed down by the ipsy crew because I can use all of this normally I don't use every single bit of makeup they give me but it's it's getting there anyway I should probably wrap up this video before I get on to rambling again and I will definitely be back next time earlier with the June Glam bag. Because I'm also kind of excited about that if they have done pretty well with this one this time. Be sure to like and subscribe and be sure to hit the bell so you know when Crazy Dave's crew posts. We will see you next time. Bye!